good. And when you look at this earth, we're, we're looking at a representation of what came out of the heart of God. For God spoke and the universe came into being. And Jesus said, out of the heart the mouth speaks. And so if the earth is good and all this creation is good, is because that's what's in God's heart. He is good. It's a representation of the goodness of God. Of course, then he gave authority over the earth to man and said, go and take dominion over this earth. The first job of man was a gardener to look after this earth. And that role has not changed. We still have responsibility to look after this good earth. But then, of course, we have the fall of man where, where uh, Adam and Eve were deceived by Satan and by that role, that thing that had happened, the dominion over the earth was given to Satan. Jesus came and took the authority back. He took the keys of hell and death. He took the authority back. The Bible says in Romans chapter 8 that the whole of creation is waiting in earnest expectation for the manifestation of the sons of God. And if you and I believe on him, God gives us power to become the sons of God. If there was a prayer that creation was praying, it's saying, come on, sons of God, deliver us from the curse. And it is up to us to step in faith into that place where we have dominion again over the earth to break the curse off it and bring the life of God and bring that creative power. So we've got to learn how to encourage ourselves and how to stay in faith. But it's in knowing who he is. So I come back again to who God is, that God is good. You are a good God. You are a God who will never abandon us. You will never abandon me. You will never leave me or forsake me. Are you there?